Well, good afternoon, everyone. I'm so excited for this year's production of The Lion King. Thank you so much for joining us this afternoon. Um, it is an honor and a privilege to present this to you. Just to give everyone a little bit of a background, we start our editions for this in the middle of February. And throughout the end of February and March, the kids work together with Mrs. Jensen. And, and, and then Dave Christman comes over and he works over at the school with the kids. And it's quite a time commitment. Um, they don't step on this stage until Monday. This couple days ago was the first time they stepped on this stage. And I can tell you, on Monday when the teachers came back after that first day, the looks on their faces was like a disaster. It was <laughs> chaos. They were panicking, the teachers were. And I just said, akuna matata. No, no worries. And you are going to see how much growth and progress we've made in three days. It is amazing. We could not do this production with a lot, without a lot of help from a, a lot of people, so I just wanted to quickly recognize those folks. The Andrea Theater, obviously, they provide us this beautiful space. They provide us the time to have Dave come over and work with our kids. They provide the crew upstairs that helps with all the lighting. This year, they even helped with the costumes. They're allowing us to use some of the costumes. A part of those costumes is all of the head dresses that all the kids are wearing. Jen Bouyer, every year she outdoes herself. This year she created every one of the pieces that the kids are wearing on her head. Thank you, Jen. I don't know where Jen is, but when you see Jen, make, make sure you say thank you to Jen. The St. Mary's School Trust Fund provides the funding that we can use to put on this production. We have to pay a, a fee to um, Disney to have this uh, um, student theater production, so we thank the, the St. Mary's School Trust Fund for that. Um, Nicole Jensen, our music teacher, obviously she puts in all kinds of time. She's there on her days off. She's thinking about this all weekend for the last month and a half. Our classroom teachers, when I came here on Wednesday, Tuesday and Wednesday, they are here. It is wildly crazy chaos, and they're just working, working, working. Everybody's hands on deck um, to make the show a production. Even our classroom teachers back at St. Mary's School, our whole schedules get adjusted during this week and last week as we prepare. So I want to thank the staff for their dedication to the program. One uh, last reminder, you do not have to take any pictures, and please don't film. That's against the rules. However, we are filming today. Heidi Hokinson is upstairs. She is filming, and we will provide a link. We will email it out so that if there's loved ones that who could not be here today, um, we can share that with you, and um, they can enjoy it as well. So with that, thanks again for coming. Akuna Matata. to our village. Today we will share with you our favorite story. One of a young lion who becomes a king. Now imagine right here the great African savanna where a wise old mandrill announces wonderful news. There is more to see 
than can ever be seen. More to do than can ever be done. There is more to But the sun rolling high through the sapphire sky. Great and small on the endless round. It's the circle fly, and it moves us all. had darkness in his soul. And the news of the lion cub's birth made him terribly jealous. Life's not fair, isn't it? I shall never be king, and you? <clears throat> you shall not live to see another? Scar! So Robbie and I didn't see you today at the presentation of Simba. That was today? Oh, I feel simply awful. Must have slipped my mind. As the king's brother, you should have been first in line. I was first in line until a little hairball was born. That hairball is my son and your future king. Oh, I should practice my curtsy. Don't turn your back on me, Scar. Temper, temper. I wouldn't dream of it. What am I going to do with him? Well, he'd make a very handsome throw rug. Zazu. And just think, when he gets dirty, we can take him out and beat him. Hey, Dad, wait up. With boundless energy. Where are we going? Who adored his father. Why'd we get up so early? Followed him everywhere. When do we eat? And wanted to know everything about everything. Are we there yet? Yes, we are. Come sit by me, Simba. Look. Everything the light touches is our kingdom. Wow. A king's time as ruler rises and falls like the sun. Someday, Simba, the sun will set on my time and will rise with you as the new king. And this will all be mine? Everything. Hey, Dad, what about that shadowy place way over there? That's beyond our borders, Simba. You must never go there. But I thought a king could do whatever he wants. Well, there's a lot more to being king than getting your way all the time. Hey, Dad, what are those birds over there? They're buzzards. They're scary. Why don't you chase them away? They're doing what they're supposed to do. Everything exists in, the, in a delicate balance. As king, you must learn to respect all creatures, from the crawling ant to the leaping antelope. But don't we eat the antelope? Yes, but when we die, our bodies become the grass, and the antelope eat the grass. Everything exists in the great circle of life. Suddenly! Suddenly, Zazu flew in and reported seeing hyenas in the Pride Lands. So Mufasa went to investigate, leaving his son safely behind. 
Simba hated missing out on an adventure, but he loved thinking about being king. Hey, Uncle Scar, guess what? I'm gonna be king of Pride Rock. Oh, goody. My dad just showed me the whole kingdom. Really? Did he show you that rise beyond the northern borders? Well, no. He said he couldn't go there. And he's absolutely right. It's far too dangerous. Only the bravest lions go there. Well, I'm brave. An elephant graveyard is no place for a young prince. An elephant what? Oh, dear. I said too much. Just promise me that you'll never go to that dreadful place. No problem, Uncle Scar. That's a good lad. Now you go run along and have fun. And just remember, it's our little secret. Hey, Nala. Hi, Simba. I just heard about this great place. Come on. Better not be any place lame. An elephant graveyard. Wow. Oh, just look. Young love blossoming in the savannah. And just think, one day you two will be married. Yuck. Ew. I can't marry her. She's my friend. Yeah, that'd be too weird. Well, sorry to burst your bubble, but that's been a tradition going back generations. Well, when I'm king, that'll be the first thing to go. Not as long as I'm around. Well, in that case, you're fired. Hem. 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 I'm gonna be a mighty king, so enemies beware. I've never seen a king of beasts with quite so little hair. I'm gonna be the main event, like no king was before. I'm brushing up, I'm looking down, I'm working on my roar. Thus far, rather an uninspiring thing. Ha 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 ha! Oh, I just can't wait to be king. No one saying do this. No one saying be there. No one saying stop that. No one saying see here. Now see here. Tail feathers. All right, we've lost him. I'm a genius. Hey, genius, it was my idea. All right, we made it to the elephant graveyard. Wow. Creepy. We could get in big trouble. Too late, you are in big trouble. This is way beyond the boundaries of the Pride Lands. Very dangerous. Danger? Ha! I walk on the wild side. I laugh in the face of danger. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> well, 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 Bonsai. What have we got here? Hmm. I don't know, Shenzi. What do you think, Ed? <laughs> Just what I was thinking. A trio of trespassers. Simple navigational error, I assure you. I'll be leaving now. Not so fast, food. How about some takeout? Make mine a cub sandwich. Time to chow down. Heads or tails? Yum, 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 yum. Simba, roar. That was it? <laughs> Come on, 
do it again. Roar! 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 You deliberately disobeyed me. Dad, I'm so sorry. Let's go home. I thought you were very brave. Minds. We be running the joint. <laughs> oh, surely we lions are not all that bad. Oh, Scar, it's just you. I'm surrounded by idiots. I practically did scrap those cubs for you. Well, you know, it wasn't like they were exactly alone, Scar. Yeah, what were we supposed to do? Kill Mufasa? Precisely. I never thought hyenas essential. You're crude and unspeakably plain, but maybe you've a glimmer of potential. If allied with my vision and brain. Hem, hem. I know that your powers of retention are as wet as a warthog's backside, but thick as you are, pay attention! My words are a matter of pride. It's clear Ooh. from your vacant expression. Ha, ha, ha. The lights are the home on upstairs. Ha, ha, ha. The words ha, have ha, in case ha, ha. Ha, ha, Even ha, you ha. can't be caught. But prepare for the chance of a lifetime. Be prepared for sensational news. A new era is tiptoeing era. And where do we feature? Just listen to teacher. I know it's so summer, but Idea. Who needs a king? No king, no king, la 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 la. Idiots! There will be a king! But you said... I will be king! Stick with me and you'll never go hungry again! Long live the king! Long live the king! So prepare for the coup of the century. Be prepared for the murkiest scam. Meticulous planning, tenacity spanning. Decades of suppression is why there's no question. He's king, undisputed, respected, saluted, and seen for the wonder I am. Yes, our teeth and ambitions are bare. Be prepared. Yes, our teeth and ambitions are bare. Be prepared. <laughs> I'm very disappointed in you, Simba. You and Nala could have been killed. I was just trying to be brave, like you. I'm only brave when I have to be. But you're not scared of anything. I was today. I thought I might lose you. Dad? What? We'll always be together, right? Simba, look up. The great kings of the past looked down on us from those stars. So whenever you feel alone, just remember that those kings will always be there to guide you, and so will I. Great kings of the past? Up in the stars? Young Simba had much to think about and remember. Uncle Scar, why'd you take me here, to the gorge? 
Your father has a marvelous surprise for you. I'll go get him. Just stay on the sled so you won't end up another mess like you did with those hyenas. Do you know about that? Lucky Daddy was there to save you, so you might want to work on that little roar of yours. Oh, okay. Hey, Uncle Scar, will I like this surprise? Simba, it's to die for. Little roar. Huh. Roar! 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 To Simba's surprise, his roar echoed off the cannon wall. Then he heard a rumbling sound, which grew and grew and grew. Hard as the weather beast were heading right towards him. Simba began to run as fast as he could. At that moment, Scar told the king that Simba was in danger. Mufasa dashed into the stampede and got his son to safety. However, the wildebeest carried the king deeper into the gorge. Scar, brother, help me! Scar dug his claws into Mufasa's great mane and whispered, Long live the king. And then, he let go. Ah! Dad? Dad, come on, Dad. You got, got to get up. Come on, Dad. Get up. Please, help. Somebody, anybody, please, help me. Simba, what have you done? There was wildebeest. It was an accident. I didn't mean for... Of course you didn't, but the king is dead, and if it weren't for you, he'd still be alive. Oh, what will your mother think? What am I going to do? Run. Run away, Simba. Run away and never return. Mufasa's death was a terrible tragedy, but to lose Simba too. So with a heavy heart, I assume the throne in which at the rise we shall come together, in which lion and hyena come together in a great and glorious future. This was the saddest day the Pride Lands have ever seen. The great ruler Mufasa was gone. With his deceitful brother Scar now in his place. And the lion cub he once wanted to come to. Ran as far away as he could into a desert. So cute and all alone. Can we keep him? Pumba, are you nuts? You're talking about a lion. Lions eat guys like us. You okay, kid? I, I, I guess so. So, where are you from? Doesn't matter. I can't go back. Ah, you're an outcast. That's great. So are we. So, what'd you do, kid? Something terrible. I don't want to talk about it. Okay, then repeat after me. Hakuna Matata. What? Hakuna Matata. It means no worries. Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful phrase. Hakuna Matata. Ain't no passing craze. It means no worries for the rest of your day. It's our problem free philosophy. Hakuna Matata. Hakuna Matata? Yeah, it's our motto. What's a motto? Nothing. What's a motto with you? Ha ha ha. Hakuna Matata. These two words will solve all your problems. That's right. Take whom here. Why, when he was a young warthog. When I was a young warthog. Very nice. Thanks. He found his aroma while after searching the field. He cooked near the savannah after every meal. I'm a sensitive 
his soul. Though I seem thick-skinned and it hurt that my friends never stood downwind. And oh, the shame. He was ashamed. Thought of changing my name. Oh, what's in a name? And I got downhearted. How did you feel? Every time that I... Bumba! Not in front of the kids. Oh, sorry. Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful phrase. Hakuna Matata. Ain't no passing craze. Please don't worry for the rest of your days. It's our problem free philosophy. Hakuna Matata. Welcome to our humble Abode. Gee, I'm starved. I'm so hungry, I could eat the whole zebra. Yeesh! Listen, kid, if you're gonna live with us, you gotta eat like us. Ew, what's that? A grub. Gross. <laughs> Slimy, yet satisfying. I'm telling you, kid, this is a great life. No rules, no responsibilities, best of all. No words. One for you. Enjoy. All right. Here goes. Hakuna Matata. Slimy yet satisfying. That's, That's it. it. Hakuna Matata. 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 Hakuna. It means no of your days it's our problem free philosophy hakuna matata hakuna matata hakuna matata hakuna matata we say hakuna 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 Mata Ta Our swimmer grew up happy and healthy when Timotum came by and he said this. The, the pride lands fell into the decay. The lionesses were forced to do all the hunting. While the hyenas ate more than their fair share. Scar's reign as king was not as glorious as he had planned. And one particular lioness left the Pride Lands to get help. Ah! She's gonna eat me! me! Nala? Is it really you? Who are you? It's me, Simba. Simba? Simba! What are you doing here? What are you doing here? What's going on here? Timon, Pumbaa, this is Nala. She's my friend. Friend? But she wants to eat us. Timon, relax. I can't believe this. Everybody thinks you're dead. But you're not. And that means we're king. King? <sighs> Lady, have you got your lions crossed? A king? Your majesty. Maybe I was going to be. But that was a long time ago. Simba, wait. I've missed you. I've missed you too. I tell you, Pumba, this stinks. Oh, sorry. Not you, them, him, her alone. What's wrong with that? I can see what's happening. What? And they don't have a clue. Who? They'll fall in love, and here's the bottom line. Our trio's down to two. Oh. The sweet caress of twilight. There's magic everywhere. And with all this romantic atmosphere, disaster's in the air. Can you feel the love tonight? The peace, the
His carefree days with us are history. In short, our pal is doomed. <laughs> You've been alive all this time. Why didn't you come back to Pride Rock? And leave paradise? Simba, Scarlet the Hyenas take over the Pride Lands. What? Everything's destroyed. But if we go back together, we can do something about it. I can't go back. Why? Look, sometimes bad things happen, and there's nothing you can do about it. So why worry? What's happened to you? You're not the Simba I remember. You're right. I'm not. Satisfied? No, just disappointed. You're beginning to sound like my father. Good, at least one of us does. She's wrong. I can't go back. What would it prove anyway? It wouldn't change anything. Tomati so, a so, a helelema. Tomati so, a so, a helelema. Who are you? The question is, who are you? I thought I knew. No, I'm not so sure. I know who you are. You're Mufasa's boy. You knew my father? Correction, I know your father. I hate to tell you this, but my father died a long time ago. Nope, wrong again. He's alive. I'll show him to you. Look down there, into the water. That's not my father, it's just my reflection. No, the Carter. Inguinyama, Nguinyama Bala. Inguinyama, Nguinyama Bala. Night. And the spirit of light. Calling. Mamela. And a voice. With the fear of a child, answers. Ay, ay, mamela. Wait. There's no mountain too great. Hear these words and have faith. forgotten who you are, and so you have forgotten me. No, how could I? Look inside yourself, Simba. You must take your place in the circle of life. How can I go back? I'm not who I used to be. Then 
remember who you are, my son, and the one true king. Hela hemoela, hela hemoela, hela hemoela, hela. He lives in you, hela hemoela, hela. He lives in me, hela hemoela, hela. He marches over, hemoela. Everything we see, hela hemoela, hela. Into the water, hemoela, hela. To the truth, hella, hemoela, hella, in your reflection, hemoela, he lives in you. Hey, Bo, where are you going? I'm going back. Good, get out of here. Just me. Have you seen Simba? No, and I couldn't care less. We thought he was with you. He was, but now I can't find him. Ha ha ha! You won't find him here. The king has returned. I can't believe it. Simba's gone back to the Pride Lands. Come on! At your service, my liege. Hyenas! You hate hyenas! You guys, create a distraction. Nala, come with me. Create a distraction? What does he want to see? Put on a dress and be the Buddha? Here. Are you tired of feeling fee? Are you craving something to eat? Come forget your troubles and sink your teeth into a luau Hawaiian tree. party they're not doing their job scar there's no food the herds have moved on we must leave pride rock we're not going anywhere if you were half the king mufasa was i am ten times the king mufasa was no scar mufasa you can't be you're dead no it's me mom simba you're alive simba simba I'm surprised to see you here, given your secret. Step down, Scar. Well, I would naturally, but all these hyenas, they think I'm king. Well, we don't. Simba is the rightful king. Well, before I hand over Pride Rock, why don't you tell everybody who's responsible for Mufasa's death? I am murderer. No, it was an accident. Simba, you're in trouble again. But this time, Daddy isn't here to save you, and everybody knows why. But here's my little secret. I killed Mufasa. No! No, Simba, please. Tell them the truth. I killed Mufasa. You don't deserve to live. Well, Simba, our own family, the hyenas, they're, they're the real enemy. It was their idea. You, you wouldn't kill your old uncle, would you? No, Scar. I'm not like you. Oh, Simba, thank you. How can I make it up to you? Run. Run away, Scar. Run away and never return. Yes, of course. 
Your Majesty, as you wish. Ah, my friends. Help me. Friends? Friends? I thought you said we were the enemy. Ed? Uh huh. Take no, let me explain! No! <laughs> Your Majesty. It is time. Remember. Pusa le bisibo, pusa le bisibo, pusa le bisibo, pusa lama. Pusa le tangobo, pusa le tangobo, pusa le tangobo, pusa lama. Thank you for visiting the our village. We hope you enjoyed our favorite story. Under Simba's rule, the delicate balance was restored. And, and the, the circle of life continues. Obosu Simbayo, Obosu Simbayo, Obosu Simbayo, Obosu Simbayo, Obosu Simbayo. Inyama Nengu Nyama Bala, Inyama Nengu Nyama Bala. Till we find a 